Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. It's been a long time. So today I've got a problem in the box all course, which I'm going to fix. So I thought I'll make a little video, upload it. Hopefully I can help somebody else out. Problem I've got is the heater blower system only works on blower number four. So as you can see, one, two, three doesn't work. Four, the maximum works. The hot and cold still work, and all the air directionals work. So after doing a little bit of research, I believe it's this, the heater resistor, I believe it's called. And this is situated by the dashboard, the passenger side, just tucked under behind the glove box. It's easy to get to. As you can see, it's got a bolt to hold it in, a clip on the left and right side, and it's got a five prong clip. So the wires that all go into. So we'll change that now and hopefully that helps. Let's crack on. So as we come to the passenger side, so as you can see, that's the device there. The clip I'm going to take out. And the device is behind that inside this white box. There's a little clip here, so you want to push that in. And then just grip it with your thumb and forefinger and pull it out. Don't pull by the cable. In case you pull the wire out, just pull it from here. Just tuck that out there just now. So there's the, the little bolt you need to take out. It's a five millimeter ratchet. So this bit here, as you can see, there's a tab there and there's a tab at the back. So you've got to try and pull them both at the same time. So if you put your finger on this tab, if needs to be a screwdriver on this one, not too much pressure, pull it out and as you'll see I'll push it back. You see that? And that gets and it comes out of his house. That's it. So as you can see, practically the exact same. The new one looks a little bit bigger actually, the one on the right. But in the one on the left there's some rust marks on it, maybe that's why the device just stopped working. Yeah, maybe that's why it did. Anyway, we'll change them and that should be it. We'll just put this one in, basically in the reverse order we took it out. Because of the clip is on this side, that's got to go on first, then push this side up and then slide it across. There we go, tighten up the 5mm bolt now. Clip back in. There we go. So that's it, the new heater resistor in. So let's check if it works. One's working. Two, three, four, perfect. So as I said, nice, easy, cheap fix that. 11, 12 pound off of eBay. Prices will vary wherever you get it. I use a flathead screwdriver and a five millimeter socket and about five minutes and that's it. So as you can see, easy, does the job, perfect. So if you like the video, please give me a thumbs up and stick around for more little um, how-to videos on the various cars we've got on the channel. So, excellent. Cheers guys and girls, see you later.